I never thought I'd be so happy to hear the word no, no, no. Hey friends, I'm Joel Kurleski, the super brave teacher, and I just got rejected. Now, I'm not a reject, I'm not rejection, but I was just rejected by a literary agent and it felt so good. Before I get into that, Please like this channel, please share this channel, please get the word out that I am on a mission to spark bravery, to make it better today for LGBTQ plus teachers and students, to make it better for myself and to make it better for all of you. So please like this channel, share it, get the word out about the super brave teacher. That's me. Thank you, friends. Let's get back to the rejection. Yes, 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 yes. First of all, I have been working my little tail off, my little tail off, getting out some query letters, more query letters for more literary agents. If you wanna hear about what that all entails, you can read my query letter, you can hear all about my book, you can click on different links I'll post. But basically, I finished my teacher book, the teacher book that doesn't exist, the teacher book that needs to exist, You Are a Badass Teacher, How to Stop Faking It and Start Being the Best, Healthiest Teacher You Know, and I'm getting the word out about this book and you gotta find a literary agent, and the literary agent is gonna make you connections to publishers and all that stuff. So I've been sending stuff out, sending stuff out, sending stuff out, no word, no word, no word. And the word is that if you don't hear anything, it's probably a no, and it's most likely a no. So it's like, you don't even get a no, it's just no. So finally, I got an official no, and it was a really nice, it was just nice to be like, someone read this, someone thought about it, someone put it out in the universe that this book is gonna happen. It is gonna happen or it's, it just felt so good because they said, you know, I'm not the one. I tried to get out a how-to educational memoir before and it didn't work, but I wish you well. Thank you so much and I hope this works for you. And it was just one of those nice, kind, honest rejection letters and it's like okay let's put that on let's put that one on the wall and like let's keep going and let's get some more rejections because the authors i admire and the books i admire the more i learn about them the more i realize that the majority of them not all of them have been rejected multiple times and it took a long 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 time to get those books out and to get the word out so who am i to think that like Little old me, little old who knows me, Joe Kraleski, the super brave teacher, is gonna get his book published right away just because I want to. No, 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 no. Yes, I wish I had more connections. Yes, I wish there was a magic button that I could just push and like the doors would open and I just have to work my tail off a little bit more and then the book would be here. But no, I'm gonna keep going and it feels so Good. To be honest, I work with kids all day. I hear yes all the time. They love life. They love kindergarten. They love, they love me and I love them. And it's one of those things where like, I don't really hear like, no, no. And it's something that I need to get better at hearing and I need to get used to hearing so that, so that I can continue to take bigger risks. And I think that you, if you, are afraid of hearing no, then you're like, I'm, I'm always gonna stay in my safe space. And I don't wanna stay in my safe space. I wanna be stretched. I wanna go to the stretch zone or flex zone or whatever analogy you want. But I wanna go to those places. And this book is just one example of the things I wanna push myself to do. And that involves hearing no a lot. So hopefully, hopefully this is one no among many and that no might lead to a maybe, and that maybe might lead to a yes. So I'm really excited about that. I'm really excited about that. I just want to end this video with a beautiful story. I wrote a friend of mine who has done a lot of editing work and is a great, 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 great with books and all that stuff, and he or she, I won't disclose who this person is, um, I basically wrote this person, I said, you know, here's my story, da, 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 and this person wrote back and said, you know, it's a crazy world out there, I know some people who had great books and spent three years to not even get published and all this stuff, and I wrote back and I said, thank you so much. Thank you for all this information. Um, I wish you well. Send you extra love. All that stuff that I always say. And I also added there, like, and if I'm crazy, and if this is truly a waste of my time, please be honest with me because there's so many other beautiful things I want to do in my life and, like, pursue a book for the next five years of my life. And 
that person wrote back and said, you know what, for some people, it is. But for you, I think it's different. And I think you really have something special. And to hear this from this person who I really admire, and that person said it more eloquently than I'm even putting it to say like, you know what, Joel, I see you and I see what you do. And I see that you actually, that the stuff you do needs to get out there more and maybe probably a book is a great idea. It was like, okay. And it, this all happened on the same day that I heard the no and also this like deep affirmation of who I am. So I'm gonna sit in that and I'm gonna be really grateful for it. <sighs> I am grateful for all of you. Thanks for watching these videos. If you are a publisher, a literary agent, or know someone who can connect me into the deeper literary world, I know very, very little about writing and publishing and all of that stuff. So hook this guy up. Let me know. I will work, like I said, two times right now, will work my little tail off. But I don't know very much about the literary agent, the literary world of agents and all that stuff so let me know leave a comment below be like hey talk to this person hey this person talk to this person but until then know that you are loved you are appreciated you are awesome because you are you and joel you heard no enjoy it enjoy the no and know that you are not a no and so often, Joel, hearing no's and pushing you into new directions because it's like the yes is right around the corner or maybe more no's around the corner and it's going to be okay because you're awesome. Bye, friends. Choo.